is Moshevika Binti Wan Ismail, my metric number is C20A1505. I'm going to describe Thomas Moran's artwork titled Frodia Sim. In 1878, this painting was created in medium oil on canvas. Thomas Moran develops a piece of art that is inspired by nature. His painting, Florida Scene, is mostly made up of natural form. The land, ocean, and sky all have irregular, frequently curving or rounded features in the southern landscape. The few trees that can be seen have long, curved branches. Bionic shapes, leaves of the palm, fronds flutter in the breeze coming from the ocean in the clear sky. Clouds are ambitious, constantly morphing into new shapes. Morin's piece is an example of the technique of a most pyrrhic perspective. The dominant object or figure of the composition on this curving palm tree is the center, jutting from the side of a sand hill towards the direction of the ocean. In the background, the ocean, a large ship, and passengers descending from the boat. These figures diminish in size giving a feeling of increased distance between them and the viewer. These faraway objects are seen beyond an increased quantity of air, moisture and sandy wine, causing them to appear much bluer and less dense than the foreground weather. Worn palm tree is complete with stroke defining each leaves of the palm fronds and intricate rings decorating the bark of, of the trunk. Lastly, the component in the background of Morris artwork lack the color intensity of the figures in front. There is less of a contrast between light and dark. It's Akman Azrim Benti Ahmad. My metric number is c 20 Next, I will continue with the analysis I study in the Florida since work. There is a balance between unity and variety in the Florida environment. The balance found in the world is the trees, ocean and sky all part of the same ecosystem. When these natural elements are joined, they form a harmonious whole. After that, there is a principle of repetition in this, in this world that is between trees, for example, in the placement of dark green, and low green sharp it is repeated along the growing from left to right not only that in this florida since work there is an artistic element that convey from off placement to create visual balance on the left there are many activity going on there are all sheep and coconut tree planted on it the last size of this landscape feature is heavy and get attention that help balance the small size. The attractive beauty of the red person of the left, the tree is visually punctuated as the tallest and has the most detail compared to other aspects in the world. Finally, variety is also the principle of art element found in the world by showing various type of plants. There are palm tree, oak tree, sharp wheat and flower in the section. The people from the ship are unique, each walking their own path and wearing different clothes. Hello, my name is Siti Nofazlin Binti Zaini and my metric number is C20A1449. Okay, I am going to describe about inter interactions of Thomas Moran's artworks. This painting showing American lifestyle in how to travel in ancient time based on ship based on ships and people can be seen in the background of Moran's Florida scenes, which is this artwork showing the ship is about to disembark uh, a group of individuals who appear to be grateful to be standing on firm grounds and they are being carried to JLC strolling, strolling. Next, depicting the life of American society, the scenery of beach views with 
tourists. This painting also depicts tourists who first come to see the beauty of the scenery in Florida. Okay, next, this artwork also also show, shows Thomas Morris love for the beauty of the American Earth. On top, Thomas Moran was born in England. He is recognized as one, one of the most famous Hudson River School artists in America. The last one is the artist may have a life in the era because this work deceives the most part of the 1990s. Okay, next I will describe about the judgment for these artworks. In my opinion, the artist managed to depict the beauty of the humidity, humidity of the corner beach of the world using the special features of the fuzzy atmosphere. This artist is very good and gave me the inspirations to create an artwork to, to describe the beauty of the atmosphere in Malaysia to how to show the audience about Malaysia unique facilities. Okay, next, by looking at the, by looking at this painting, I was able to add new knowledge, which I was able to know and describe ten accidents. Will describe the ancient time of the American nations. And the last one is, this artwork managed to attach the interest and inspire the audience.